Oh man, let me log into this crazy Keela's life on YouTube, man. See what all the bugs is about. Become a lunatic like all these other people. It's crazy Keela. Crazy Keela's life. It's crazy Keela. Crazy Keela's life. Crazy Keela. Subscribe, become a lunatic. Hey, y'all. Hey, see, I got my little stocking on my head because I'm wearing a wig today and I'm about to eat breakfast. So, who cares? But I'm starting off this vlog. I'm gonna let y'all see what I'm having for breakfast. Check this out. I got me some eggs, cheese eggs, bacon, blueberries, and strawberries. That's avocado toast on wheat bread with everything bagel seasoning and sriracha. That's how I like mine. So I'm about to grub in just a minute. I was just um coming on here. I am going out to eat with my son today. So um we gonna have all oh, the focus over there in here. We're gonna have lunch today, so I'm just gonna throw something on, not nothing spectacular, just something to look decent, so I can go ahead and have breakfast. I mean, lunch with my son. Hold on, I'm I'm sorry, I'm holding this camera. But yeah, but I'm gonna hit you back in a minute because I gotta grub. Sorry. Hey y'all. Uh, you counting, Pooh? We, I'm on my way to drop Zora off, pick Al up, and good job. Um, pick Al up, and then drop the kids off at my mom's house so that I can take him out to. She, this thing is moving. See, that's why I don't like this little car thing because it just be doing the most. Um, back back to what I was saying. Um. I'm gonna um, drop Zora at work, pick Al up, drop the kids off at my mom's house so me and Al can do some lunch today. So, right now I'm on my way to drop Zora off to work. You know, this little thing I got, it's hard to find good stuff. It just bounces around. To me, it make, make me feel like the, the thing is moving around what it is moving around. But, um, I don't know, it just makes it seem like my videos don't be looking stable. That make any sense but on my way to do this decided to wear this because i didn't feel like putting no makeup on so and all doing my eyebrows i was being lazy today did they turn it in here okay yeah they turned it in here okay go ahead honey um but i didn't feel like what are they doing tell me um i'm sorry i didn't feel like putting no makeup on today it just wasn't one of them days i feel like put makeup on so I just put a wig. I was gonna wear my longer wig, but I don't know why I thought it was kind of gloomy out here. And though I was gonna wear my wig with the bang, my long wig with the bang, but I said, nah, I'll just go with this one. And I have like a, a scarf. That scarf is kind of loose. I may have to tighten it up. See y'all, my scum a little bit Louis Hine, twirly thing. I'm gonna have to tie, I'll tie that back on when I get to where I got to go. Al probably gonna have me waiting outside for a few minutes anyway. I gotta call him to make sure that he knows that I'm on my way. So I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Hey y'all, y'all see what I did with my little bow? I tied this little Louboutin twirly on my head and made a little bow on top. Don't know how cute it look, but shoot, I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. I don't care. You like it? Mm-hmm. So I did this while I'm waiting for my son to come out. I don't want to take him so long. He need to hurry up because I'm hungry and I got to take my mom and um, take the kids to grandma to grandma house. That's right. There you go. There you go. He about to come in and get in this car so we can go ahead and do what we're going to do. I don't look too shabby today. I mean, I ain't trying to do nothing too much. I just did, I wanted to look decent when I came out. That's it. Um, Got my little braces. This braces I got from Shein. They holding up pretty good, but I don't wear them that often. I wear them every once in a while. Where'd he go? 
Did he go back in the house? I went when it was every once in a blue moon, but I decided to put on my Bowley today. And that's on. I don't know why I put it on. Be honest, I got this little necklace thing too from Sheen. I think. I think this guy. I got this from Sheen too. And I got my Louis Vuitton earrings on. But um, of course, I didn't get that from Sheen. But um, hey, babe. How's it going? Everything going good. Hi. So I'm about to take my son, I'm take my drop my kids off me and my son about to go out to eat. Say hi to everybody, Al. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so let me um get back at y'all in a minute. Wee. See, I fixed my little thing on my head. I'm at my mama's house. I'm gonna let y'all see her dog. Hold on for a second. You see this dog again? <laughs> that dog got a lot of energy. Look, the kids is having fun. You see him? <laughs> like you fool. That go, that's my mama. Look, look, look. Kenny. <laughs> that dog is excited, ain't it? She's excited. Look at her. <laughs> she faster than I can record her. That go my son playing with him. With her, with her, I'm sorry. I'm still playing with her. She got a lot of energy. We about to go out and get some to eat. We about to leave this dog alone. She get too comfortable. She done laid on her back and everything. Look. She done laid on her back, kicking her little leg. Look. Look. That's the spot, right, Amaya? Amaya say, that's the spot. <laughs> that's what she thinking. That's the spot right there. All right, kids, I'm leaving, Fat Man. Fat Man, mommy going bye bye. He don't care. He like give mommy hug and kiss. Fat, fat. Like you want to give mommy hug and kiss? Thank you. If I leave without giving her a hug and kiss, she has fit. I'll give her a hug and kiss because she's going to get mad if you leave without giving her a hug and kiss. I'll hug and kiss. Hug and kiss. Oh, mm. We're about, about to get up out of here. Mm. See you, sweetie. Yeah, you really burned that food. I did burn it. <sighs> I got my little messy, messy wig on. Wait till you bring me something back. <laughs> Ooh, look how looking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at my keys. Oh, my keys. Well, let me go ahead and get out here and get some food. I'm going to make a cheese snack. I'm going to pick up some McDonald's or something. Oh. We getting sushi or something like that. Let me go. You got anything to say to my peeps out here? Uh, hello. That's my son, y'all. A little <laughs> crusty. To, a little pop. crusty today, but it's alright. <laughs> y'all, that's my first love right there. I don't know what I'm doing with this little bow on my head, but I'm wearing it. I look a little cute. We have PF chains right now. I'm gonna um, put y'all up. In a minute, so y'all can see our food when it come out. I order some um, dynamite, a dynamite roll or something. I, I ordered it before; it's pretty good, and I think I wanted the sesame chicken, but I want them to make it spicy because I like spicy and see what they can do that. And I order some gray with some water because I gotta have my water. But I want to drink today. Wanted to treat my son out today because I haven't been out with him in a long time, right, baby? So we having a date. We on a date. I think I should wear my other wig. Look at me scrutinizing myself in the camera. Who cares? Let me pull this wig back a little bit. Yes, that's just better. I pulled it back in the middle of the day. I pulled it back. It looked better, see? I don't care. People are like, oh, she put her wig back. She put her hair back. She do that. It's fake. That's why. Right. Maybe do it because it's fake. Mm -hmm. I'm cute or whatever. I don't know if I'm feeling like this little thing on top. I think I'm going to take it down, honey. Because I don't know if I'm feeling this little bow on top. I'm taking it down in the middle of the restaurant. See, that looks much better. I was looking like somebody's daughter. I mean, I am somebody's daughter, but you know what I'm saying? I'm a grown, grown woman. I'm not a little grown woman. I'm a big grown woman. I will put this in my purse. Um, I don't know what to do with it. I'm gonna put it in my purse. That's what I'm gonna do. That's what we're gonna do right now. Hold on for a second, y'all. 
Yeah, yeah I don't know. I, I ain't thinking. I know I just like my stuff spicy, so. Do you both want lunch or dinner? I want the lunch one. You want beef? I can do lunch one as well. And you can do white rice, brown rice, or I want brown, brown rice. rice. Yeah. How about beef? Yeah, it's probably rice. Enjoy your drinks, and I will check on your sushi. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, thank you. Red and green. What you got over there, Al? Let me see that. I just want to see. It's, it's what? It's a cider. Oh, it's just a cider. I thought it was like a beer. Oh. It's cider. He's a cider type of guy. <laughs> I'm so silly. So I decided to get, like I said, they won't do the um. I said that um, like sesame chicken. Off. You want to sit over here? Oh. Want to sit beside me? Oh, you want to sit right across? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna guess. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I needed to take that thing off my head because I was looking real juvenile with it on. What y'all think? What you think, Al? Was I looking real juvenile with that little balls? <laughs> no, I had to take that off, honey. Save that for a different day, honey. When I'm wearing a headband wig and I put it on the front. <laughs> but ooh, see that looks much better that headman was not that mean that little totally thing wasn't doing it justice i mean it's cute but not for this it's not built for this wig i still don't like the way this this scalp is but it's here it's all good <sighs> this one will be cute or whatever I don't know what else we're doing that time being here. I was thinking about walking around here a little bit, give grandma a little bit of time to chill with the kids so we can hang out a little bit. You know they got like a pet store around the corner. Okay, definitely a little bit of a pet store. Probably a can for your treats or something. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I don't know the only choice. Yes, I just drunk my juice like mommy. I said call it juice. This is the I call it. I'm grown well. That's our shrimp. Well, I that's our sushi with our shrimp on top. It's called dynamite roll. We about to dig in that right now, y'all. About to dig in there. My son ain't paying me no attention. <laughs> I'm gonna try to eat with these. Um, I've never mastered eating with these chopsticks. My son know how to do it. I'm gonna try. So if I if I look like a whole fool. Y'all don't laugh at me. That's all I'm saying. I'm going to try. Oh, my God. I've never mastered this. So, this is the reason why. I'm so, do you so hold good. it like a pencil? No, it's like in... It's kind of like in one hand holding it like a... I don't know. It's really just using your first two fingers to really do most of the work. Like this? the other one. Like this? I mean, that, that gets the job done. You're doing it. Mm. <laughs> it's pretty good, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I have a stick of one right here. Them before. Yeah, of course, since you know me, John and Darius are black, would be culturally appropriated. But 
different. It's so be good. Yeah, I'd be like, I don't know. Why did the Power Girl Girls break the beat of us? Oh, because they were bad guys. So you want to be a bad guy? Uh, it's, it's either Roddy Rough Boys or just be Guy Powerful Girls, but it's just the same thing. <laughs> it's the same thing. <laughs> It's the best wish for me. Oh, yeah. My case. Very good too. I was telling Zora and Shadi, I said, I had a date with Al in a mm -hmm. long time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was gonna. So I wanted to talk to you first. He was alright if you King was there. I was gonna ask Laura if she could watch King. I would quick I'll take her. You don't mind him being outside sometime, right? He won't run away, will he? He can't fit underneath the gate. He how big is this thing underneath the gate? <laughs> well, we, it's the same way it was before. Remember how yeah. Gizmo used to sneak? It's pretty good. I know he'll enjoy it more than anything. I know I'm buying a kid to like it. Mm -hmm. I also have some other things I'm thinking of. Uh, I know Kendrick and Amaya wouldn't would like it. Mm -hmm. Now she can see if it would be good with him. Hopefully you guys can probably get a dog in the future. Mm -hmm. no, I don't know. I do plan on getting a dog for them. When I I didn't, well, Amaya different. graduated from pre-K. So soon? That's like what, next year? Next year. Next year. Well, I guess technically next summer. And that's only because I want to make sure he's going to be in daycare by that time and she's going to be in school. Make sure he's big be, enough and old enough to know better and she's old enough to be slightly responsible to be able to help out. Yeah, and my experience. thing is that, I did, and my thing is that too, it's kind of hard for me to walk a dog with them. So, yeah, if fair. they're in school, it'll be easier. Very true. I can't leave them in the house and walk the dog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Whenever you go, let me go with you. <laughs> I want a little. I'm probably. I gotta find somewhere. When we go look at these dogs, I'm gonna show you what kind of dog I want. I want a teacup dog, mm -hmm. a little small, okay. foo foo dog. Okay, Yeah, I was gonna use chopsticks to eat this and like I don't feel like struggle busting it through. I'm trying to get this rice with chopsticks. I can put this on there if you want. Yeah, I'll put yours up there. Uh, we were actually weighing our plates the other day. Oh wow. <laughs> I think this one's almost 10 pounds wide. By itself? Oh, Jesus. You got some, you got muscles. <laughs> yeah, we about to go into this pet store and look at some pets. 
That's what we do when we out and about. That is, isn't it?
put this camera on the thing. I'm so pissed off right now. I'm on vent, and I just got home from my date. Um, Amaya wanted to stay with my mom because she wanted to stay there. But I'm pissed, and I'm gonna tell y'all why. I'm sorry. I'm sorry my hand is in the thing. I'm, I, I'm brushing. I'm gonna tell y'all why. Because I was supposed to get a package delivered today, right? And we have the, I have the worst post office delivery person. They'll say they deliver my package. They put it in the wrong boxes. People be missing their mail all in my neighborhood. And I'm really pissed off because I was supposed to get a package today. Y'all know I'm an event planner and I was going to get a package for my event. They said return to send, send, uh, sender for an insufficient address. And I knew that was incorrect. So... I called to contact the post office, the um, that 1-800 number. They said, no, that's the right address, but it's going to go back to sender because that's the way they put it in. What? This postal person don't like to do their job. And I have reported them, and they continuously take me through these changes, and I'm really, really getting pissed off right now because they messing with my business. This is what stuff, this is, I need to be able to have the stuff for my events. I don't need to be waiting to get my stuff or my stuff getting delayed to get delivered because they don't want to do their job. And I got to rush up here. It's 3.30. I got to be there before 4 o'clock to make a report so they can at least hold the package when they get there, and I can come up there and pick it up another time because this is absolutely, this is not... <sighs> I, 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 I'm, I'm at a loss for words. I'm so mad right now. Because I didn't want to come back in the house. I had to take my wig off and everything. I had to put the wig back on my head. Luckily, it don't look too crazy. But I had to put the wig back on my head. I took my clothes off. I put slides on and took my little shoes. I had some little um, boot heels on earlier. I took my little boot heels off. So I just put some slides on. Threw my shirt back on. Because I had to walk around the house with my thigh high and leggings on. Honestly. With my wig off. Just free. It's a bird. Now I gotta rush out. I'm so aggravated. I, I'm so aggravated. I almost wanna cry. That's how mad I am right now. And I was just about to sit down and upload a video to my YouTube for you know to schedule a video to be uploaded. And and, and I, I'm, I'm I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off to the highest pissed off for the guy. I am. I am. Uh, ooh, I'm mad. Because and I and I think I'm mad because this is not the first time. It's Stuff like this done happened several times. And I'm just sick of it now. I'm sick of it. Then somebody gonna have to do something. Because I'm sick of it. And when you start putting my business at risk for me not having stuff that I need, because that's that's not that's not that's not what's working with me. That's not I'm not doing I, I can't do that. I can't that doesn't work for me. And I'm just pissed off right now. I'm really pissed off. So I'm running to this post office. Hopefully, I get there in the next few minutes because I just I because I can only imagine what the line will look like. First of all, do I got my mask? Because they may require me to wear a mask, and I don't even think I brought my mask with me. Cause I I think I left my mask. Dang it! Did I bring my mask? I don't think I may brought my mask. Yeah, I got my mask. Oh, honey, I got my mask. I'm sorry. I was holding the camera because I was so mad. This thing was bouncing all over the place. I'm sorry, y'all. <sighs> Don't be too mad. I'm going to catch these people. I'm getting sick. I'm, I'm just sick and tired. Of my, my son works for the post office. But not this post office. I mean, he does work for the post office in another area in North Carolina and Greensboro. But this post office is the worst. And I'm sick and tired of them. I'm just, I'm so sick and tired of them. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired of them. The postal service sucks. And um, at this point, if they're going to send it back and I got to wait for it again, I'm going to have to order from somebody else and then wait for them to give me my money back. And who wants to do that? Who wants to do that? Nobody wants to do that. I don't need that stress in my life. Like I told y'all, I suffer from anxiety and my anxiety is on a thousand right now because of this. Um, I'm OCD, anxiety, and I suffer from depression sometimes. Right now, I'm not depressed. I'm on a thousand right now. So, they, they lucky if I don't run into the post person that I won't take my wig off and fight them right now because I'm so mad. I'm fighting mad. Because, like I said, this ain't the first time. 
that they did something like this and I'm getting pissed off. One time they scanned one of my packages and they scanned it for couldn't get to the address. We're not in a gated community. How you can't get to my address? What your little, little truck broke down? What happened? Say your truck broke down. Don't say my address is, is unattainable. How's my address unattainable? Uh, unattainable. Please explain that to me. My address is not un unattainable. I'm so mad I can't even talk. And then another time they scanned it and said they delivered and hadn't delivered. Well, 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 my package ain't here. Where is it? Three days later, my package shows up. Why would y'all say y'all deliver if y'all didn't deliver? Now we having issues. I don't have time for these type of problems right now. I got businesses to run. I don't have time for this. So, excuse my wild look, my wig. It look kind of cute though. But I'm I'm upset right now. Cause this crap don't make no sense and now this midday traffic and stuff i gotta rush through all this stuff to get to this place on time to get my damn mm, jesus be a fence all around me every day because i'm pissed i could have been went a different way why did i go this way <clears throat> the sinus is acting up i don't know what else to do i don't know what else to do I just need to hurry up and get to where I gotta go. But I'm about to get off this phone. But when I get in that post office, I will record because I'm I'm pissed. I'm fi spitting fireballs. Mario Brothers spitting fireballs, pissed. I see y'all. I'm in the post office now, and I'm really aggravated right now. Look at me. Look at this craziness. I had to take my jewelry, all my earrings, all my stuff, stuff from my ring, my watch, everything. <sighs> and I'm gonna have to turn this phone off when I um, cause I gotta show them my tracking number, my information is in my phone. Be right back to each other in a sec. I gave them the information. She's gonna talk to the supervisor cause she can't see it in the system. He's gonna try to figure out what's going on with it. I guess. So I get back to y'all in a minute because this is a lot. And I just told her my whole complaint on this route driver and all the issues that I've been having with the route driver. So hopefully they'll fix everything. Let's we'll see. Okay. Came out the post office. Did get a package, but not the package that I was looking for. That haven't came back off the route yet. So basically they told me they got my information. They put the tracking number that it's going to get delivered tomorrow. But basically they saying some of the packages come up with partial to the address rip. So they don't know where it goes. But that doesn't explain why perfectly fine packages don't get delivered. Because they scan them whatever they're going to scan them. So um, with all that being said, I should get it tomorrow. If I don't get it tomorrow, we're going to have a problem, 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 problem. I promise you. So, um, because I'm so upset right now. This is like, so I did get a package. Like I said, I'm going to let y'all see in a minute. I opened it because I was like, what was I supposed to be getting there? I forgot I, I ordered the Hermes belt. So, um, that actually came in the mail. I'll let y'all see that real quick. Hold on. I'll let y'all see the box. I opened the package and that was like, wait a minute, I think that's Hermes. I think that's an Hermes stuff. Because on the package, well, I don't want y'all to see my address. But um, and I can't remember ordering it. That's the crazy thing about it. I'd be ordering so much stuff, I couldn't even remember ordering. But that's neither here nor there. I got it now. So let me look at let y'all see this. Hold on. So that's my belt, y'all. Not what I was looking for. But like I said, they say my package is gonna be delivered tomorrow. Hopefully that is the truth. Hopefully, I'm sorry, I'm holding the phone because I didn't even put it on the thing. As soon as I got in the car, I started talking to y'all. Hopefully that is the truth because I don't have time for these games. Who got time for these games? I don't have time for these games. Mm -mm, not me. Not I. Not Mara. I don't. You do? Okay. So, I don't know. I'm just ready to go home now because I'm put. I'm, I supposed to have been chilling in the house, uploading a new video, and I'm up here running about doing the post office job. Find out where my package is. Trying to figure out where my package is supposed to be. They need to get it together. Because even if the address was partially ripped off or something like that. Okay. What happened to all the other times that I supposed to have been receiving packages? They put it in other people's boxes. I received, they said they delivered it, and I received it three days later. What happened to all of that? I just need to know. Tell me what does, does that is that that matter at all? 
Does it matter at all? That's all I want to know. Somebody need to be doing their job. That's all I'm saying. Because when my package is supposed to get here, it's supposed to get here. It don't supposed to be here five days later when they said they scanned it and said it is here. Is that my in my mailbox? Placed in my mailbox. Gave to person. What person you gave it to? I ain't seen you. You lying. Stop lying, liar, liar. Pants on fire. Piss me off. But... I need to have a drink. I'm gonna drink me a glass of wine when I get home because this is way too much. I'm gonna drink me some water now just so I can cleanse my body and my system for my wine later. <sighs> Cause I need it, honey. I need it. But that's neither here nor there. Let me drive safe and get off this phone. I'll see y'all in a bit. Hey y'all, hey y'all. See, I took my wig off. Got my just my little ponytail out. But this is the thing I wanted to say to you guys. Okay, I'm turning over a new leaf. I know I said I'm a fat girl I like to eat, and I do. Fat girl I like to eat. But my daughter challenges, she's making the challenge with me. I'm gonna cut out all bread. I'm like 192 pounds right now, okay? I'm gonna cut out all bread, all sugar, like chips and stuff, gone. Pasta, gone. And I'm gonna see if I can lose 20 pounds by July. And um, I'm going to try to keep this way of life up. It's hard. I've done it before and I actually lost 30 pounds in one month. But um, it's very hard in my household because everybody in my house, they don't eat good. I'm the only one that we actually tries to eat well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. And I have to just act like I'm allergic to all other foods. I, I mean, I, all the foods that I can't eat, I'm just allergic to for now on. That's what I'm telling you. I'm allergic. I'm allergic to bread. I'm allergic to pasta. I'm allergic to sweets. It swells me up. Because it does. I'm about to drink my... Hold on. I'm about to drink this tea. Matter of fact, I'm about to put it on in a minute. Hold on. Give me a sec. I'll let y'all see. China Slim Tea. I'm drinking this for 10 days. I hope I got two packets left in here. I probably don't. Probably don't. I was drinking this before. How many packets I got? Hold on. I got three. So I'm gonna be drinking it for three days. Okay, but I got some other detox tea. But for the next three days, I'm gonna drink this cheap damn China Slim tea. Try to get some of my, this stuff out my system. So I'm gonna drink this tea. And uh, and I'm gonna let y'all see what I'm eating because I'm trying. I'm, I'm, we we we, are, we gotta help each other. We gotta help each other. You know what I'm saying? And I probably do my nails this weekend. I'm not really sure, but I'm really gonna work on this whole thing with this um this 20 pounds that I want to lose because I, I think I lose. I, I I think this is the problem. I think I mm, I think I can. Get rid of this right here, but I was because I didn't I didn't always have this. I got this when I gained weight, so I think I can get rid of it. Oh shoot. Hold on. My damn thing is Jesus, be a fence. My computer cut off. Okay, I'm sorry. I think I can get rid of this if I was to lose if I was to lose weight. So that's what I'm gonna do. Because I, 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 actually, I like the thickness I have getting get back in in my thighs, but I'm getting this too. This is not what I want. I don't want this. And I want my face to be a little slimmer. So I'm going to have to lose weight, which means I'm going to lose my thighs and all my, but I'll get firm. So I don't care. It don't matter. And I fit my clothes a little bit, just a little bit better. So it's all good. But I want to say good night to you guys. I'm going to take a shower. Just pick my daughter up from work. I'll take a shower, get ready for bed, watch some TV with my husband. So, y'all, you guys, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button, become a lunatic, okay? Because we crazy over here, but we love it. Crazy, but we love it. Crazy, but we love it. All right, like, comment, subscribe, become a lunatic. Peace.